Welcome back. Financial planning can be a super rewarding career. Today we're going to talk to two young financial planners who candidly talk about why they do what they love. Well, I think one of the biggest challenges I've had in my career so far is being a younger player in the, in the industry. It's sort of that native stigma about financial planners are meant to be 50-something year olds and you know you want that worldly wisdom and things like that. So it, I guess it's a success as well because I've come around saying, well, how do I prove uh, my competency and that's just, that comes out through your technical knowledge and things like that. So the way you overcome it is by showing your technical skills and you remind them about the fact that you'll be there for more than just one life stage. So you're not going to be retiring the same time as them. You can be them through post-retirement, be there for the kids, so you're there for a bigger part of their journey, which is such a huge value add and a lot of clients actually do value that. Oh uh, yeah, so I suppose uh, in terms of my challenges, well, we work in quite a small um, business and really there, there's so much scope to, to what you do in financial planning. Um, it's a great challenge in that you know, every day is different and you're across so much of business in terms of marketing and systems and um, clients and processes and uh, but I think yeah there, there's so much to know yeah. um, and then on top of that you've got all of the technical the legislation um, and then the, and then the rules get changed every year when they put the budget out so um, it's definitely a challenge but it's something that I really enjoy and, and it's yeah. it's great that it's very difficult to know everything, so there's always something more that you can be learning and um, so, somewhere where you can, can be better, learn off somebody else or, or yeah. from a course or something like that. So yeah, uh, yeah I think that's it's definitely a challenge, but, yeah. but, but a good challenge as well. Uh, the biggest successes, well, I'm just, just about to start a new um, financial planning business, so I'm hoping that the biggest successes are yet to come. Um, but I, I think that in, in my current role, we've had a lot of success in uh, building a service offering that's really relevant to the, the sorts of clients that we want to work with. And uh, it has been a process. It, it took us, you know, well over 12 months to do that. But we've seen, once we've, we've got that right, you know, we, we've seen how that works and it gives people confidence and um, we get to work with people the way that we want to. And, and to me, that's, that's a good measure of success as well. What about you, Aditi? Great. I think my success uh, up until this stage is just more the clients that have come in to say thank you for getting them to where they really wanted to be and it's not, it hasn't always been an easy journey, but knowing that you've played such an important role in terms of being their sounding board, you know, keeping them on check and on balance to make sure they are on track. Those are sort of the little successes that I get reminded about every time we have a meeting every so couple of months, so I think that's pretty amazing. Well, I hope that was helpful and I hope you agree that financial planning could be a great career for you. If you want more information, follow us on Facebook or follow Grad Mentor Student on LinkedIn.